guys, welcome back to Altered Stangs. If you haven't done it already, I'd appreciate it if you could hit that like button, uh, subscribe, and uh, hit that bell notification. So if you've been following along with the videos, you know all about the tubular and the modifications I've made to it. So hopefully we'll get that onto the silver car and get up to the dyno at some point, see if it made any difference at all. Um, for those of you that don't know the silver car, the silver car is a 1988 silver coupe and it's got a GT40P headed uh, B cammed Cobra intake, uh, one and three quarter inch headers, three inch exhaust with cats up until the tailpipes. They're just two and a half inch, but only because I didn't have the money to uh, change them out when I did it. So I've had a lot of Fox bodies in the past and they've almost always had a power adder, some sort of booster nitrous. And I've been driving the silver car around and, and it's a nice little combo, works pretty good, but I've been missing the boost lately. So I live in Ontario, Canada, and I started looking for a used supercharger kit. In the past, you could pick these up for $1,500, $2,000. $2, and I started shopping around, and the prices have really gone up lately. Uh, a used supercharger, a Vortec or a Paxton kit, uh, the cheapest one I saw was about $3,600, all the way up to about $4,000. So I didn't want to pay that for a used supercharger, so I did what a lot of people have done, and I turned to Amazon and found this guy. So what that is, is a GT45 Turbo. Um, it was about $350 shipped to my door, and it says it supports about 600 to 800 horsepower. Now, I don't need anywhere near 600 horsepower. Like, like, I mean, we always want more, right? But it's just a stock block combo, so, you know, if I could make 450 with it, I'd be plenty happy with that. So what might make this build a little bit different from the average turbo build is that we have some pretty strict emissions we have to follow here. You have to keep everything on the car, which I've always tried to do. And we're going to have to pipe this thing around the smog pump. So this is a project I hope to do this winter. Uh, it won't be done in like a week or two or anything like that. And I still have some other projects I've got to get to. If you've been watching the videos, we've got Project Basket Case, which is our coupe from Shaved Engine Bay Issues. So... Um, I've got to reassemble that and get it ready to sell in the spring. I've also got the Altered Stangs Beast, my YSI Coupe. Got to get ready for the summer. Really looking forward to driving it. I've never had it on the road, but uh, hope to change that this year. So, just a quick update on some stuff we're playing with. Wanted to show you guys the turbo because I'm actually really excited about it. Uh, for the money, I can't wait to give it a try. So, um, yeah, that's where we're at. I hope you'll check out my upcoming videos, and until next time, remember what we say here at Altered Stangs, leave no stang unaltered. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.